Guys, welcome back to another segment. You know the way we normally do it. I'm always here to give you updates that concerns Chelsea and Chelsea alone. Finally, um, Tottenham has been out of the Champions League and PSG has also been out from the Champions League without any goal. The same thing with Tottenham. No goal. Starting from the first leg down to the second leg. PSG considered three goals and without no return. Why Tottenham considered only one goal? Well, this is very, very shameful for PSG. After all the score, after everything, after the likes of Messi, Mbappe, Neymar, all of them, name it. They're there for PSG, but still yet, nothing to write to me about. Well, but before I proceed with everything I want to tell you guys today, please kindly like this video, share, and most importantly, don't fail to subscribe to this channel because on this channel, I only give you updates that concerns Chelsea and Chelsea alone. Well, um, it's a pity that um, after much talk yesterday, hoping that PSG will, will come back. Instead, they went there, they went there to fool themselves. And Bayern Munich just swept them off the Champions League, just as usual. I don't know what is happening. PSG just spend money, get players, get scored, and nothing to show for it. It's very, very bad, yeah. After all, the Messi, Mbappe, all of them, nothing, nothing. I was hoping that they would win Bayern so that at least if we, if they don't give us, if they don't give us Benfica, which I'm not praying for that, at least PSG, because I'm not scared of PSG. Like I told you people, it's not about the qualities of player, it's about the teamwork. Bayern has teamwork than PSG. That is why you see them play like that yesterday. Then, um, AC Milan has qualified. To the quarter final i told you guys yesterday that it is better they give us ac milan than benfica or bayern munich which i'm seeing that happening very soon when they would make the drop maybe after next week after next week my likes of man city and their dress play maybe the draw will come out definitely definitely we are hoping to see ac milan i'm hoping to see ac milan because benfica no 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 benfica is a very tough side very technical and very tough side when it comes to this Champions League football, it's better they should even pay Benfica and Bayern Munich than Chelsea and AC Milan to be very good, to be okay than pairing Chelsea to Bayern Munich. I'm not I'm not disputing the fact that Chelsea cannot play Bayern Munich. After we won them in in their own ground and won the Champions League, that was during the time of the dropout. That was the time when though we did not have coach then the material just had luck and the luck followed him and he won the champions league but you see now you see this time though we have scored this time or chelsea have scored but i cannot just tell you that this squad can play bayern munich with the current state at which bayern is right now you understand bayern is good no doubt but chelsea can still shake things but me for be to be at the safer side let them give us a similar even though a similar remove us to despite the fact that we beat them in the groups and uh, group stage it won't be bad too but i know that if chelsea meets ac milan in the quarter final is an automatic semi-final for chelsea i'm not bragging that but that's the truth okay um so far so good um this saturday we'll be facing leicester city and that match will be kicking off by 3 p.m hopefully the likes of mudrake should be expecting should be expecting mudrake on that that match it's not like i told you people he doesn't have any issues with chelsea some people are just speculating over exaggerating that he has personal issues he not have any issues with chelsea just that I, I i just believe that even before that champions league Potter has already discussed things with him and said that okay guy just chill we we'll just play this one like this you understand now i'm going to call out some players for you that chelsea possibly chelsea will be looking into all these players in the next summer transfer which i want to mention right now so sorry in case i don't pronounce the name well you know that these players their names are something else i don't know the kind of names they normally be here. but i'm going to call them for you those are the players at chelsea definitely chelsea will be looking into their transfer and don't forget too we have jao felix which chelsea is also putting interest in despite the fact that he's our player he's not our player for now he just came home on, on a loan deal atletico can say we are not selling him or we don't want him to go but definitely if chelsea should bring a good offer they are going to send jao felix to chelsea on a permanent deal 
you understand and with the look of things jafel is already okay with the situation in chelsea and also is okay playing with chelsea and also his balance playing in the club you understand so definitely chelsea you should look into that contract then i told you that some players will be leaving chelsea like likes of likes of missy mount um hakim ziech uh love to cheek they, they will say all those ones um Caesar Spliqueta. I don't know. I don't know, but Caesar supposed to go. Then this guy. Should I play again? Matthew Kovac is nothing yet. His contract, no talk concerning that one for now. But I know that definitely he might retain he might like to stay back in Chelsea or he might leave Chelsea. So one of these players on my on my on my list right now, according to Ch the Chelsea Chronicle, he said that Chelsea make contact with club stop club top scorer and tell him they want to sign him this summer and this player is no other person than um is a primary player is no other person than rafael viaga attacking midfielder rafael viaga well i don't know but let's just see how it goes let's just see how it goes rafael viaga like like i told you everything that concerning transfer is based on speculation and rumors you understand no confirmation yet just like the likes of Tamir Tami abraham now which is speculating that definitely chelsea might bring him back and the release clause for him to come back is about 70 71 million pounds for him to come back from roma you understand so some of these players i'm mentioning is based on speculation that we are going to make bid for them you understand then we have another one on our list according to pys is that breaking news chelsea and manchester united are trying to persuade the japanese midfielder than chikamada to join them instead of brusha dotmore who are understood to have a verbal agreement that she and kamada is a japanese player is an attacking midfielder too is another player that Chelsea are putting their eyes on. The same thing goes to Manchester United. Manchester United, they took eye too. Then we have another one on our list to Chelsea are keeping tab on Vaka Varakalia ahead of the summer transfer window and see him as a potential replacement for Hakim Ziyech that should he leave Chelsea. 20, 27 matches played, 12 goals scored, and 15 assists. He's a winger. He's a winger. And, and I guess, I mean, how old? I guess he's just 22 years old. He's a winger. He's 22 years old. Nationality is a Georgian player. You understand? So those are players that Chelsea are looking to see if they are transfer can pull through. But all the same. Chelsea have qualified. That's the most important thing. Tottenham did not qualify. Chelsea is the only London team that has qualified in the Champions League. Then qualified to the quarterfinal. I mean, Bayern Munich have qualified. Benfica has qualified. AC Milan has qualified. So we are praying that they should give us AC Milan. That is the prayer. You understand so guys that's the update coming from the camp in case of any other thing that drops i'll drop it this evening and don't forget i still have a finalized talk with mr clement i know that you guys are waiting for the both of us to come out and tell you people what is happening in chelsea and also explain some certain things that will be going on in the club but so far so good Potter has been relieved of some his mental stress you understand that does not mean that the fans are relaxed though we still they put eye for anybody we still they took eye for anybody you understand so guys that will be all for now do it to like the video share and most importantly don't forget to subscribe to this channel because on this channel i only give you updates that concerns chelsea and chelsea alone thank you very much